What about you? Today we're going to be fixing this bumpy lawn. All the tools shown in this video can be hired from your local hire shop. Our next step after aeration is to do this process, which is called scarification. We do this to remove this material here. This is what we call thatch. It's a layer of organic material that naturally builds up in the soil. It's perfectly acceptable to have some thatch in your lawn as it helps retain moisture and keep the lawn healthy. However, whenever you get a lot of it, then it starts to choke the lawn. To show you the lumps and the bumps in this lawn, the easiest way is just with a line. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe for more videos like this. Let's go. So today we're going to be using 100% topsoil. The main reason for that is the soil that's in that lawn is topsoil. There's no point trying to change the composition of the soil at all, especially we want the seed to take. We just got this from a, a building, the local building supplies. There will be some stones in this, but I'm going to show you how, to, how we deal with the stones as we go. It's important just to put a bit down, level it out, put more down. Keep doing that till you get it reasonably up the top and then we're going to get the lawn load out and start to level it out. I talk about this in all my leveling videos. Big rake there, really handy, this big straight edge on it. Let's push and move soil about. I'm coming to my final rake on this bit. There's a few stones sitting on the surface. So we're just gonna pull them off and put them into the next hole. We're coming to the end of this bag here. The best way to do with these bags, a lot of people cut them, but we use them for the scarf fan. So we actually fold them down. We'll roll them over. And you get right into them then. Without too much hassle. Um, it's just like working out of a new bag. There's the, obviously the full bag. And then there, there's a wee half bag. It's folded, rolled down, easy. Just as an easy tip. So now we have it all pretty much raked off there. It's fairly level. We're going to get the lawn load out now and give it the final level. These things are pretty good for doing small areas, I guess, here. I've turned into a big fan of a lawn load. Next job now is just to give this a quick final rake off, to give the seed something to stick into whenever you throw the seed down on a, on a very flat surface, it's gonna have less to stick onto. So we're just gonna give all these areas a quick 
rake, a really light, light tickle, just to create a bit of a seed bed for the seed to get into. Today, I'm just gonna put it on like chicken feed with my hand. If you didn't know the amount of grass seed, you could measure the area out and measure the amount of seed that you need for that given area, and then you'll not be too far away. And then just a really nice slight rake. Just a good seed to soil contact. A tickle. Make sure to watch this video here next and I'll see you over there now.